that's okay. Is it all right if I scream? What? I'd like to scream. Yeah. Sure. really fucking good. Maybe I should give it a try. It helps. <sighs> I'm sorry about your friend. Thanks. Well, we weren't really close. He was more of a friend of a friend. If it's any consolation, there's a 70% increase of ER visits during the holidays. There's an increase of suicides, DOIs, even knife wounds. Jesus. Is that supposed to cheer me up? Yes. Misery enjoys company. You're not the only one having a fucked up 4th of July. I was supposed to meet with my ex-girlfriend, so my night wasn't going to be good from the start. Oof. Sounds worse than any trip to the ER. <laughs> Ever think about dating a nurse? No. You should think about it. They make good wives, especially the ones who work in the ER. Why's that? Well, yesterday we had an 11-year-old girl who had her throat ripped out by a pit bull. The day before that, we had a 40-year-old dad with cerebral hemorrhaging after his son accidentally hit him with a baseball bat. And the day before that, I can't even remember. Because that's the kind of shit an ER nurse deals with every day. And why exactly does that make him good wives? Gives them perspective. They don't sweat the little things. They know they're gonna end up on that gurney one day, dying in misery. So, they try to enjoy life all they can. There are other people that deal with death, cops and soldiers. Do they make good husbands? It's not the same. They do the killing. We do the fixing. The first thought I had was that I liked this girl. She was weird as hell. Even weirder than I was. She's one of those people who has no idea how fucking crazy they sound. Or maybe she just didn't care. Either way, I liked it. 